Have you ever wondered why we have arches on some of our structures? Let's dive in and find out. I'm Sofia Gutierrez with the California High Speed Rail Authority coming to you from Fresno, California. Behind me is the Cedar Viaduct along with its four arches. This 3,700 foot viaduct will carry 200 plus mile per hour high speed trains over State Route 99. Each of its arches are nearly 179 feet long and nearly 40 feet tall. Dating back thousands of years, arch bridges were commonly built by stone or brick. Today, we see arch bridges constructed from concrete, as you can see here at the Cedar Viaduct. So what purpose do arches like these serve? The arches help us achieve our goal of crossing over State Route 99 and ensure our tracks stay flat and rise and turn gently as designed. The arches are curved so they can support themselves while also hanging a lot of weight from them. Without the arches, the spans behind me across State Route 99 couldn't be as long unless additional columns were put in the middle of the highway to hold it up. Essentially, arches are fierce gravity fighting machines. Cedar Viaduct isn't the only structure with arches along the high-speed rail alignment. Just a few miles away, you can see similar arches at San Joaquin River Viaduct, our glorious gateway to the Central Valley. So next time you see these beautiful arches in the Central Valley, remember, this ancient innovation is getting a modern makeover thanks to the California High-Speed Rail.